this video thank you so much for stopping by in case you are new here my name is Christine and if you are returning thank you so much for being part of this family thank you for always coming back to watch my content for the likes for the shares for the comments I really do appreciate guys I really do appreciate your support on this channel yeah guys so uh, I just went to the supermarket to do a little bit of restock yeah this uh, you know January months are always tough due to school fees uh, uniforms books that we we parents get to buy yeah so it's not been easy on this side also it's been um yeah it's been shaky shaky but yeah so my part of some of my foodstuffs had run out some were running out and uh today's on 21st today's on 22nd i think uh, today's monday on 22nd so i we still have around eight days eight or nine days to the end of the month yeah so i just went to get some few stuff so i also had these uh um points shopping points are uh, from naiva so i wanted to use them so that's why i decided to go uh, to naivas to do that shopping there i had accumulated those points and um i just felt that i need to use them this month of january of, of course they've, they've after all they've been helpful they've come in handy so much in this broke month yeah so i want to show you what i just got from there then uh, my twins are almost uh their time for being picked is almost so i want to also prepare them tea yeah tea i want to prepare them tea so that when they come back they get something uh, ready then i'll do dinner maybe at around uh, five yeah because as i had told you i always make early dinner because of the uh, big girls i don't them to i don't want them to do lots of work when they come i don't want them to be running around uh, helping up with the dinner because um they really wake up very early to go to school and they come back late yeah so i just want to give them time so i want to prepare dinner early today and i also want to make tea right now for the twins yeah so let me just show you uh, what i got and uh, don't forget to like share leave a comment down below please please like the video so that it can be recommended to other viewers we need to grow we need to grow this channel we need to get this channel to 10k subscribers by the end of the year guys yeah 
So I got some rosy tissues. I got some snacks. Yeah, one for each, one for Nara, Noi, for Yvonne and Nicolette. Yeah, so I got them uh, four snacks. I got some margarine. Then I got some milk. Uh, I think I got six pieces of milk. Yeah, I got six pieces. These are six pieces of fresh milk. I got some mala. So I got six pieces of mala. Yeah, so these are six. So the reason why I got six is three. Uh, we will have three in one uh, for one dinner. Then uh, three for the other dinner. Yeah, so this will sort us for two days, two, two dinners. I got some, this uh, tiny uh, mandazis. I really love these mandazis and uh, my kids also love. So twins will be having this. Uh, they will be having this with them. Um, with uh, the 10 o'clock tea when they come from school. I also got some two spaghettis for the kids. They really love spaghetti, so they'll have this over the weekend. I added a packet of kavagara, though I have two packets in the house. Yeah, so I added one. I also got this. So this is uh, this is osubuko, but uh, most of the times when I buy osubuko, I request them to cut into tiny pieces so that I can cook it as just uh, as to, um, the, as they are tiny like that. So I got uh, this is uh, this was seven twenty. Yeah, this was seven twenty, but a kg always goes for six hundred and nineteen. So this will sort us will sort us for dinner. This is one kg. So we might have this for two days. Yeah, two days. I got a toothpick. So I got some myself this uh, Maya Pishori sunrise. I've never had this. But I just want to make it, then I, I'll i see how it tastes. Though the, the other packet, the orange packet is usually very, very yummy. So I just picked this because this was cheaper. It was 250 Kenya shillings. So I ran out of sugar. So I got 2 kgs of sugar and this was 230 Kenya shillings. Yeah, so this will take us up to end month. Yeah. And... Uh, I also got so for the soap I got two pieces for the kids. Yeah, these are kids, and this soap is very nice. It's made of lemon and honey. It's a very nice soap. Yeah, so I got two pieces. Also, I uh, wanted to try out this powder soap. Yeah, one of my fans told me she uses powder and um, and liquid soap. So I decided to buy this. Uh, 700 gram so that I can try it out sunlight so this was 219 290 or 219 Kenya shillings I also got this for the kids one packet is 70 shillings and Nicolette really loves this with spaghetti so I decided to get her this one so that they can have it with spaghetti over the weekend. Yeah. And uh, I also got uh, this one. This is uh, this is chicken breast. Uh, this is a half kg. Uh, yeah, this is a half kg. And uh, I want to make this. I'm not sure if this will be enough for all of us. 
yeah uh, i'll be making i'll either make this for dinner or we will do mala either this or mala yeah and the last thing the last thing i got is bread yeah so i might make uh sandwiches for their breakfast tomorrow using this bread uh, because the twins don't eat just plain bread like this they really hate plain bread so i might use it to make a sandwich for tomorrow's breakfast so this is all i got and uh, this costed uh, like uh, six thousand kenya shillings from my neighbors accumulated points yeah so they came really they came in handy so you can always accumulate your points so that they save you uh, when you are so much in need yeah so you can always just be patient accumulate them and uh, one day you can use them to buy something or uh, just shop for some food stuffs yeah so i want to pack this then i make tea for the twins before they uh, come from school
So for dinner uh, we decided to just have mala and uh, leftover kienyeji vegetables that were in the fridge so the kids topped out stopped up with some little skuma wiki yeah so i made this ugali so ali and we had this dinner by 6:30 p.m. I always love mala because uh, most most of the time when you don't feel like uh, cooking, yeah, you just do mala with some veggies. And it's good to also have uh, these veggies in the fridge. If you have a freezer, uh, just be making uh, some more. When you are making dinner, be making extra so that you just keep the rest and uh, have them when you don't feel like cooking. The next morning, I had some laundry that I needed to fold. And this, uh, most of these are uh, laundry that we did when we were deep cleaning my kid's bedroom. Yeah, if you haven't watched that video, kindly check up my last video. Yeah, we did a deep cleaning of the kid's room. So we also did laundry that I didn't show in the video, but we 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 cleaned their beddings, uh, duvets, uh, duvet covers, and bed sheets, and we also cleaned some little clothes that were in their laundry basket. Yeah, so that is what I'll just fold uh, this morning, and then I'll go straight and away and make my lunch because I haven't eaten anything. Uh, yeah, so I need to have lunch at around twelve thirty one before. I go to pick the kids from school.
So for lunch, I want to make this chicken breast uh, that I bought uh, from Naiva. So I will just go ahead and cut uh, the and cut them into stripes. Yeah, I will cut them into stripes. Then I will uh, marinate the breasts for around three hours. Yeah, it's good to marinate for overnight if you have that time. But uh, I I didn't I forgot to marinate it yesterday. So I'll just marinate for three hours. Then I'll go straight away and cook. So I will be using uh, some uh, spices here. Yeah, that is uh, black pepper, turmeric, uh, cumin powder, onion powder, uh, paprika. Yeah, those are the spices that I'll be using. And I'll also add some cornstarch and uh, marine. And yeah, I'll also marinate with cornstarch and cover it. Keep it in the fridge for three hours. As my breasts are being are being marinated, I'll just proceed and um, prepare whatever I'm going to use. So I have red, yellow, and uh, green pepper here, and I also have some carrots. So I'll just cut all of them into stripes. Yeah, I'll go ahead and cut all of them into stripes. I really, really love uh pepper especially when they are mixed colors all of them i really love them though the yellow and uh, red pepper are usually very expensive so you find that the green pepper we buy at 10 shillings but for the yellow and green pepper uh, the cheapest you can find them is 30 shillings a piece So I'm um, putting some little oil on my pan. Then I will go ahead and put in my striped chicken breast and uh, cook them on uh, medium heat uh, for like uh, around 10 minutes. So I always love to ensure that they are well done. So I'll just put them aside on a bowl. Yeah, this bowl, don't mind it. It's dirty because it's the same one I marinated the chicken with. So there's no need of taking another. So I'll, I'll then put some oil on the same pan and uh, put some onions plus garlic and just saute them yeah, so that they become tender before I add in my uh mixture of uh, peppers. As my onions saute, uh, I'm going to prepare some sauce mixture here. So I'm using tomato paste, dark soy sauce, uh, tamarind sauce, and barbecue sauce. These are the only sauce I have in this house. So I'll also mix some corn flour, and a little water so i'll mix them together yeah and i'm going to use this uh, later on so just stay tuned and you'll see how i will use it my 
onions are done so i'm going to mix uh, with the peppers and uh, mix together cook for around uh, three to five minutes uh, yeah then i'll go ahead and add my chicken so i'm trying to spice it up with some salt and uh, royco powder yeah So right now I'm adding in my chicken. I'll just mix together. Then the sauce that I had made is what I'm going to pour inside and mix. Then uh, cook, cook it for around three minutes and it will be ready to serve. My lunch is ready so I was cooking this rice uh, separ on a separate cooker on a separate meko so I'll just serve the uh, rice and uh, the chicken then uh, I will have my lunch if right now it's around 1 30 yeah so by the time I finish this uh, my time for picking the twins will be almost so i'll just clean my dishes and then go and pick the twins so you can also try out this recipe uh it's very yummy so and very easy to make it doesn't take long also because chicken breast cooks very fast yeah so try this out and you will enjoy it Thank you guys for always watching my videos to the end and uh, I really do appreciate. Please don't forget to like, share, leave a comment in the comment section, even uh, just a love emoji. And I will see you in my next one. Goodbye.